A weather alert from Pinpoint Weather 12. Lots of changes to go through over the next 24 hours. We'll see some of the, those changes occur over the next several hours. Let's get a look at live Doppler radar. You can see we're covered in green, which represents rain, but you look off to our north and west and you can see we've got some whites and blues up here, some pinks. That's a mixture of snow and snow uh, out across central Connecticut and maybe even seeing some wet snowflakes in northwest Rhode Island right now. Our threat tracker for the afternoon at that medium level as we are expecting the light rain to turn over to a light snow, generally coatings to maybe a half inch, most of that on car tops and grassy surfaces. Now for tonight, probably staying at that medium level. The snow comes to an end this evening, but any moisture on area roadways will likely be refreezing. So kind of keep that in mind for the overnight. Any untreated roads could be slick tomorrow. Although very cold, we're not looking at any uh, severe weather. Let's get a look at Newport. We've got uh, some raindrops on the lens and cloudy skies. Here's a look at Providence. We've got a bit of a breeze here. You can see we've got some light rain falling 47 degrees. Busy wind from the north Northwest 14 miles an hour, bringing in the colder air. Look at the temperatures elsewhere. 37 now in Chapachet. Maybe some wet snowflakes up there already. 42 in Richmond, 51 in Newport, 47 in Taunton, Cumberland. Our live weather information there. 40 degrees at the moment. Meanwhile, Tiverton. 49 degrees, so that cold air is moving in from the northwest into the southeast and everywhere will likely be below freezing uh, probably by 8 o'clock tonight. Satellite radar picture showing this pipeline of moisture working its way through New England right now. Cold front has passed through most of Rhode Island, now working its way through southeastern Mass and behind it some pretty cold air working in at the moment. It'll be a lot colder tomorrow. We'll show you that in a second. Hour by hour forecast shows uh, some wet snowflakes moving in 3 o'clock across all of western Rhode Island and by the evening commute. I think we're looking at wet snowflakes across most of southeast New England. Skies clear out tonight and then we're looking at some uh, very cold air to arrive for your Wednesday, especially for the morning and into the afternoon, staying cold but dry through the evening tomorrow. Forecast for the rest of today. Expect the rain to turn over to snow, coating to an inch possible. Generally coating to a half inch is expected. Temperatures falling down into the mid 30s by four or five Five o'clock this afternoon. Now for tonight, overnight lows down to 19 degrees. Snow ends by 8 p.m. Then skies clear out. Winds pick up. Maybe some gusts 30 to 40 miles an hour late in the night. Now tomorrow morning, starting out in the teens to around 20 degrees, and in the afternoon, only up around 30 degrees or so. And with the wind chill, it'll feel a lot colder than that. Here's a seven-day forecast. Now tomorrow, again, we are starting out really cold. Wind chills at the bus stops. Kids are probably going to need the uh, uh, hats and uh, gloves and warm coats tomorrow morning, starting out with feel like temperatures in the single digits, feeling like the low 20s in the afternoon. Now on Thursday, we are looking at the potential for some record cold. By the way, tomorrow we could be looking at a record low temperature and a record cold high temperature. More record cold possible Thursday morning, but in the afternoon it won't be as uh, cold, up to 38 degrees. Gets a little bit more back to normal on Friday. So some uh, crazy changes over the next 24 hours. Be sure to track them with our Pinpoint Weather 12 app. You can get live interactive radar and weather wherever you are, if you iPhone, iPad, and Android devices. So uh, stay tuned for later today. Tony's got an uh, important update at 5. Some brief foreshadowing of the season to come, because then we rebound a little it's bit. It's a long winter. All right, tomorrow morning we'll feel it. TJ, thanks so much. Stay with us for stories coming up tonight, starting new live at 5. That includes your latest Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. And then new at 5.30, a new warning now from the FTC. What they're saying about a real estate scheme that promises you can earn money by flipping houses. And new at 6, we're hearing from members of Rhode Island's congressional delegation ahead of tomorrow's impeachment hearings. We'll have those stories, plus all the day's breaking news later on Eyewitness News. Remember, if you're not home by 6 o'clock, you can get an update on all the day's big stories every weeknight. Join us for that on Eyewitness News at 630.